Hey paper makers, today we're gonna make two book lighter, which I have made out of checkered paper, and this is also foil paper, which has, and you can see it's awesome things, which sometimes when it even comes down, it spins on this axis, and it lands on my couch, what do we with its things diagonal facing up? But the people who don't have this, I am very, very sorry for you guys, but the only way to make this is to have this thing, I mean, lift it up, oh man, it's heavy. This gigantic paper plane box that I have made, and it gives these huge sheets of paper. To, and there's also a designated paper for each plane, and you can make a lot of cool planes, like this, um, like these cool planes, like the walk nose jet, and the needle nose glider tornado, F-16 Falcon, um, F-22 Raptor, Gigantic Sonic Glider that flaps its wings, Fighter Jet, Needle Rocket, and of course, Two Point Glider, just to name a few, and also Gigantic Glider. So, you can get this at Barnes and & Nobles, and it also gives these folding instructions, and it also gives these, and it also says which page you can get it, and it shows how the plane looks, let me show you, like this is needle rocket, and it shows the designated pattern, and there's a few of those kinds of papers, and you can take one of those, and it gives the folding instructions like this. So today, we are gonna make two point glider. And it looks like this. And if you have the paper, it doesn't, some of them, it doesn't show the designated paper. But you can figure it out by looking at this. I, uh, I have the box I just showed you. And there's no blue checkered paper, but there is this red checkered paper. So I'm sorry for you guys who don't have it, but you can buy it at Barnes & Nobles. So... We we'll start. I I don't know how to fold it, so I, I folded it, but I don't remember. So I'm just looking at the instructions. So fold the right edge to the left edge, of course. You just you guys just fold it because of course all of you know how to fold it. It's the easiest fold in the history of the world. <coughs> okay, yeah, I have a comment. And create creases like this the only thing you have to do now is just do the water bomb base guys of course i've showed you water bomb bases i'll show you it on f30 falcon x if you don't know how to do the water bomb base just look up on the video of f30 falcon x or if it's easier just look up on this video so after you fold it in the half the people who do know just fold it. So after you fold it in half like this, yeah, after you fold it in half, fold this edge so that this thing becomes a point and this edge aligns with this edge like this. And then do the same thing on the other side. But the way to do it easier is to fold this t point to this little ending edge. I know it's a little hard to fold, but just try to do your best. So then, turn the paper over, and then when this intersection just pops up, immediately please. Like this. The easier way to do that is poke it on your nail, and then align each crease, like the center crease and the edges. So do that, open it, flip the paper over, and you see that big intersection there? Just poke on that dot, like I'll show you. When you poke that dot, like this, all those layers pop up. And then, it's the hard part, pull into these layers. Pull in these wires so you have this big, like, parachute-like thing. And squash fold that like this. 
and then crease on every edge you see that is bulged. And now what you're supposed to do is fold the left and right parts of the creases. Like, I'll show you. Oh, I was like focused on watching that because I have no idea what to do. Okay, let me do it or let me show you. Uh, so you have this, right? Fold these points onto around an inch away on this edge from the top point. So that would be like somewhere around here. And then do the same thing on the other side. And you have to always match the one that you just did. Like you see mine's matched. And then create creases by folding the new top flaps in half, as you can see in the book. I'll show you. On, you know, step, um, what step is it? Step five has three parts. Go to the second part, like right there. I know my, I have like a book hat on. I know I can't see it, but let me show you. Basically, this is what you want to do, but let me show you quickly. Like just fold this thing in half and then take the whole pieces off. And do that on every side. And like from this point to the other point. And then open it up. And you have this. I, I, I folded it back to the starting point of step five. Now, come, I get, fold on these creases again, and then watch this. It's really hard to fold. After I do it, let me explain it. Finally, did it on one side, and let me show you the explanation on the other side. It's a hard, it's hard to show it on camera. I know, but I'm gonna try my best to show you. When you do this, fold like, oh man, it's hard. Okay, you have this right here. Wait a minute. Let me just show you. Fold this edge onto this edge, let me show you. If you do understand, fold it, but don't worry because I know that it's not gonna lie flat. But the people who don't know, you don't know it's gonna, not gonna lie flat. But now the thing that you have to do is that you have to like, it's hard to show. And let me first do it. It's like this. When you open this, you have this, right? Uh, let me, how do I gonna explain this? Uh, squash for this part and make a point like on the other side. Like this, what this? Let me do it step by step. Squash fold, and then I have this, but flatten it, okay? And your paper should work like this. Turn the paper over. And then fold this thing back. Like fold on this crease. Let me show you.
here. So, yeah, this way. Let me show you. Yeah, this. Pull down on this. And when you do it, I know your fangs are not going to do it, or your two points. But then move it up. I already have. You couldn't see me because I was doing it on the other side. So have you ha after you have this, fold it in half. So you have this. Now we're ready to fold. Wait a minute, my points were uneven. Let me do it. Now we're ready to fold the wings. Now, the place we're gonna fold the wings is right, you see this bulge here to there? On that half line, right there, fold there. Like, right here. So your things will appear, and of course, just match your first crease. And after you do that, open your paper up, and you should have something more like this. And it looks like a dart, but it's actually supposed to glide. So if it glides and it, and you sad that it's not like a dart, don't worry. And oh, also, I'm glad to show something. Fold, don't fold it, but kind of bend this back edge up. Like this, like I'll show you, and bend it a lot until it bends some. Like this, so it will catch the wind. Like this, so it will work like that. And always make your two points aligned. So, bye.